Hello gamers, welcome back to Fallout 3. Okay, so in our last episode, we have checked this uh, Dunwich building. This this one right here, and it was full of crazy shit, you know. Well, and I was right, you know, it was actually uh, inspired by the uh, Cthulhu mythos from the HP Lovercraft. I checked, I checked, it's the Dunwich Horror, the Dunwich Horror is his, his book, yeah, I haven't read that one, but, you know, I am familiar with the works of the HP Lovercraft. He is kind of a pioneer, I would say, in the uh, horror genre, right, you know, in the literature sense. What's that? Abominable mutant. Was it like a head of his or something? Yeah. Well, anyways. So, after exploring the... Oh, shit. Of course. I'm talking right here, you red scorpion. Here, take it. Take it. Now, I as I was saying, uh, the building was inspired by the Cthulhu mythos, you know. Usually, usually in uh, HP Lovercraft books, the... Uh, there's some there are usually some cults that uh, worship some some universal gods or something like that you know which are which are usually kind of I won't say that they are benevolent the opposite of benevolent you know malevolent yeah probably that's a word I I wouldn't know exactly okay let's just let me just keep me stealthy I I, I prefer it that way so, as I was saying, usually those cults uh, uh, worship the gods, you know, like, I don't know, the Cthulhu or Dagot, uh, what, are, what are their names, and uh, usually the gods don't give, don't give a fuck about them, you know. And that is kind of the point of the... Uh, of the H. Lover, Lovercraft mythos. Usually the gods in his tales are so, you know, powerful and... Uh, otherworldly that they just don't give a fuck about us people you know which when you think about it when you think about it it's quite logical you know if god is this omnipotent being i would say he has a bigger bigger problems you know on his on his chest than you know worrying about our problems you know yeah you know for instance we don't we don't care that much about the you know troubles of of ant, yes, let's say, or insects. Come on, come on. You're just embarrassing yourself. Yeah. Okay, anyway, that's enough about that. Was it Brahmins? Is it a caravan? No, it looks like Jack regular Brahmin. Well, as I was saying, enough of that. We are continuing to the Girder Shade. If I manage to find it this time. Or not get too distracted with the exploring, you know. I mean, it's, it's ri ri literally right there, so. Oh, I see. Now, let's say this is all new location to me. Okay, where is the entrance here? Okay, we'll just let's just make a let's make a hard save, right? Okay, girder shade. Why am I getting pl just plus 40 XP? Don't I have well rested? No, I do not have well rested. Okay, mm. what is it? A boat fly? Come on. I want to find a place to just rest. I don't know, this looks like an uneven ground. Yeah, well, we'll find it eventually. So this town is like underneath the bridge, highway bridge. Let's can we enter here? Mm, well, there's there's no one here. Okay, some bottle caps. Let's just take it. Okay. 
Okay, just nothing special. Just regular poor man house. What do we have here? This is like a bar? Okay, we finally have some resin here. Yes, that's locked. And yes, I can see you eyeing it. Oh, she has a lot of nuka colas. Let's try to talk to her. Sierra Petrova does the name. Good to see a new face in Girder Shade. I take it you're here to check out my nuka cola collection and take the tour. No. <laughs> I'm thinking I'd rather be smacked in a can with a blunt instrument. Mm, no, I'm not that really interested in seeing your collection. Well, okay, let's indulge her. Oh, come on. Yes, of course. Well, come on then. Let me show you around. But no free Nuka Cola until the end of the tour. Okay, she's really gonna show us around? I mean, what is there to show? When Nuka Cola was invented by John Caleb Braverton in 2044, it quickly became the world's most popular soft drink. Wait, did she say 1944? The Wonder Drink soon drew a dedicated following, which prompted the Nuka Cola Corporation to release many promotional items like these. Okay. By 2067, a Nuka Cola machine such as this rare, pristine model could be found on almost every street in America. Well, she has a nice fridge. Best looking Even wasteland. In today's crazy world, Nuka Cola is still the number one choice of refreshment among Armageddon survivors. Well, that's just because they don't have anything better to drink. As promised, here's a little pick-me-up. An ice-cold Nuka Cola. Just look at the frost on the bottle. So cold and delicious. Pardon me. <clears throat> I tend to lose myself when I hold on to a Nuka Cola. Before I get to the little proposition I have for you, let me tell you a little bit about Nuka Cola Quantum. Okay. Just cut to the chase. What is this proposition? Okay, let's just uh, play down Quantum. Never heard of it before. Well, right before the bombs fell, the good folks at Nuka Cola developed what they hoped was an improvement on the original formula. Calling it Nuka Cola Quantum. It was said to have twice the calories, twice the carbohydrates, twice the caffeine, and twice the taste. So, what went wrong? Well, the flavor certainly wasn't the issue. The public was just split on the unique feature of the quantum's appearance. You see, to make it stand out on store shelves and to give it that extra kick, the formula called for a mild isotope. The effect was a drink that not only boosted your energy, but also glowed with a bright blue light. Okay, wait, did you say it has isotope in it as in its, re as in its radioactive? Is it radioactive? Oh no, only ever so mildly. No ill effects were ever recorded. Really? Well, it does have the unique property of making your, um, your... Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay, glowing pee? That sounds like a dangerous stuff. Oh no, not at all. Nuka Cola Quantum was made under the supervision of the Food and Drug Association. They would never let harmful products end up in stores. Yeah, of course. What's your interest in all this? I love the stuff. I can't get enough of it. I thought I was hooked on regular Nuka Cola, but the Quantum beats it by a long shot. I've got to have more. Okay, she she sounds she sounds like an addict, right? So, that's where I come in, I guess. That's right. You bring me Nuka Cola Quantum and I pay you. Handsomely, I might add. 
For every bottle you bring me, I pay you some caps. You know, for expenses. But if you're super cool and find like enough bottles to fill my Nuka-Cola machine, 30 and all, I've got a super secret cool prize for you. Come on, Sarah, no secrets between friends. Oh, okay. I have a schematic for the Nuka Grenade. The only one in the whole capital wasteland. Bring me the bottles, and it's yours. Imagine the look on the target's face when they are burning alive in an effervescent explosion of cola and fruit flavors. So, what do you say? Will you bring me the bottles? Okay, Sarah, you got the deal. Oh, goody! I can taste the quantum already. Good luck to you, sweetie. Okay. Do you know someone named Grady? Nope. Sorry. Who is Grady? Is there anything else interesting to see near G the shade? Well, to the east, there are some nasty raiders in Evergreen Mills. I'd stay away from there if I were you. Luckily, we're kind of hidden here under the old highway, so no one bothers us. Tell me more about Nuka Grenade. I don't know a whole lot about weapons, but I do know that it's more powerful than a regular grenade. It explodes in a huge blue flame, too. How cool is that? What do you know about the Nuka Cola Quantum? Nah, I'm gonna regret asking that, that question. Well, besides what I've already told you, not much. They were working on a way to prevent the glow from remaining once it passed through a person's system, but it was never perfected. I heard that the stuff they use to make it glow and give it that kick has a shelf life of over a thousand years. Should make the bottles easier to spot. Medicine. Drinking that stuff can be good for you if it contains radiation. Well, I, I guess so. I heard that sometimes the radiation would remain in people's systems, but only in a few test cases. All you need is a little rat away, and poof, the isotope is gone. What exactly does a bottle of Quantum look like? Well, the bottles are glass, just like regular Nuka-Cola, except the glass is clear. That way, the glowy stuff inside shows through. You'll know it when you see it. What happens when you drink a Nuka-Cola Quantum? Oh my! It's like a tidal wave of flavor washing all over your body! Your head spins, but everything is clear at the same time! It's quite a rush! <laughs> Man, I don't know who I should have done this. I mean, I wanted the schematic, but, you know. It's not good for you, Sierra. You seem kind of addicted to the stuff. Is it safe to drink? I mean, we okay. already know it. Why would you say that? I can stop drinking it any time I want. That's so silly to think I would get hooked on the most delicious soft drink ever devised by man. Let me ask you about something else. Okay, shoot. Okay, I do even have a clue as to where I can start looking. In fact, I do. <laughs> yeah, some Nuka Cola factory, Surprise probably, you, right? I? Your best bet would be to find the ruins yes. of the DC Nuka Cola bottling facility. Find the shipping manifests inside. With them in hand, you should have a good clue as to where the quantum was delivered. While you're there, you may even be able to find some bottles of quantum. What do you know about the Nuka-Cola bottling facility? Well, the DC facility was like their main factory just before the bombs fell. All the research they did was performed there. It was the only facility to ever produce quantum. They were in a test market mode, and they would have expanded production if the drink caught on. Too bad they didn't. Otherwise, quantum would be as plentiful as regular Nuka-Cola. Now, I don't know if I was already at the Nuka-Cola factory. Okay, I have to go. Hurry back. Maybe I'll make some of my legendary quantum sorbet. Man, I'm wondering if she is even eating something or just drinking Nuka Cola. Okay, just let me check how much of the Nuka Cola quantum do I have. Four. Well, okay, I can give her that. Please, tell me you have some of the good stuff. Here's all the Nuka Cola quantum I'm carrying. I knew I could count on you. I promise to put them to good use. Okay, four, and we get what? 160 wild guys. Oh, we got no experience? Man, that's a shame. 
Okay. Okay. I, well, I could steal the Nuka Cola. I mean, we're, we're like literally helping her with this. I don't know why I'm losing karma, man. I'm saving her life. There. Oh, one more. Hey, Whoa. Pal, what were you doing in Sierra's place? What do you care, man? What's it what is it to you? Because I'm making sure that no one messes with her. She's my girl. Oh, okay. She never said anything about you two being together. Well, that's likely because it's none of anyone's business but ours. She's one hot lady though, am I right? A little crazy. What is wrong with you? You're sick. <laughs> but why? What you're driving at? Wow, you are as naive as you look. How do I put it? I'd love to do the horizontal bop with her, you know, plow her bean field. Come on, kid. Oh, you didn't already? Well, man, must be tough getting rejected in the wasteland, and you're not a ghoul. Well, okay, can't say I blame you. Now you're Let's indulge him. Language. Well, only problem is she won't give it up for me. That's where you come into the picture. Oh, really? Sounds interesting. Go on. I know she's asked you to find her some Nuka Cola Quantum. Heck, she asks everyone that wanders through here. What I'm proposing is you still look for the drinks, but instead of bringing it to her, you bring it to me. She'll be so impressed that I got all the Nuka Cola for her. She'll melt in my arms like butter. I pay you the same she was going to pay, and everyone's happy. How about you pay me double for each quantum bottle? No, Failed. I don't think so. Take what you can get. Sorry, not, not interesting in your well, offer. Look, don't answer me now. Just keep it in mind. If you find some and you've had a change of heart, I'll still buy them. Oh, and I wouldn't bother running back to Sierra and warning her. She won't even understand what you're talking about. Why shouldn't she? She may be a hottie, but she's a bit vacant in the smarts department. And she's still rejecting you, man. My offer still stands. Bring me Quantum and I'll pay you for it. Okay. Well, look. Oh, she may be... Okay, okay. Just relax, man. So, uh... Wait, do we have anything else here or just two, two houses? <laughs> Wait. There's just two people living in Girder Shade and he still can't get, get, get laid? Man. Okay. Okay, let me just check. Are there any other locations to enter? No. And that guy is hopeless. Oh, what that claw. Okay, let's finish it. Oh, come on. And rest. Now, let's try. I mean, maybe we can rest. I don't know if we can. We, we probably can't rest in the house. Okay, let me see. I mean, this looks like an uneven ground. But I'll try anyways. Probably won't be able to rest because there are lots of enemies. No, no, not not that one. 
the bed. I need the bed. Oh, nice. I didn't expect that. Okay, let's rest for 12, 13, 14, 16. The one in the morning, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, let's do it like that. Okay, we're well rested again. <clears throat> okay, let's see. What should be our next lo location? Let's just continue north. Okay, we are fully rested. What's our... Hunger is minus two, and that means it still gives us minus one, but we should drink some water. Whoa, whoa. I mean, I did hear something, but I don't see anything. Oh, let's let's hide ourselves. Man, these dead claws. Wait, wait, I missed him. Okay. I mean, this dart gun is gonna save my lo life a lot. There's no way we would be able to do that without the dart gun. Okay, what do we have here? Just some eggs? Yeah. Not thirsty, yep. Yeah. Thank you for the information. What's that? Oh, enclave, enclave, okay. Let's see what we have here. Okay, the dead clouds are on the loose. Wait, did the dead cloud kill all of the enclave troops? Or are they waiting for me in somewhere in the ambush? Okay, let's shoot one. Let's shoot the other. Okay, let's just... I mean, they won't see us, right? Yeah. Okay, we have just microfusion cell here. So is this camp, like, abandoned or something? No, it looks, it looks like they died. Maybe the dead cliffs have a, uh, you know, run amok and uh, kill all of the enclave soldiers. However, they wear their heavy armor, so I see something. Nice. Man, they got obliterated. Mm, is that all? Usually they're like minimal three soldiers, right? One was here. Other one, maybe one more somewhere, no? Okay, let's try and deal with the dead cloth. That's one. Well, that was easy. Maybe that will spawn in some enclave troops, right? You know. Like, it, like maybe it triggers them or something. 
Although I doubt it. Let, let's just scout the area for... Or maybe one more Arkley soldier. Was that not just a stone? Okay. Well, looks like that's it. Oh, I see him. Yeah, I knew. Because it's always minimal tree, you know? Okay. Now, let's continue north. Okay. Something popped up on our compass. Some new location. Okay, what do we have here? Ab abominable mutant. Let's shoot him with dart, dart gun. I'm still wondering about that door that I saw there. It's probably... It's probably part of the... What was the name? Of the Rockland car tunnel, right? I need to check what's up with that tunnel. But I guess it's probably some DLC. Another boat fly. Oh, come on. Ah, well, I'm not gonna chase after a boat fly. Or bloat fly, whatever. I don't care. So what do we have here? Is it a fire gecko or... Yep. Golden gecko. Oh, I can take its skin, right? No. Not necessarily. So let's see. We should be able to see... Our surroundings from here. Oh, another enclave station. They're also they're also wiped out here. And what happened to them? Why are they wiped out? In two locations. That monstrous duck. Okay, just kill him. Seventh experience. Why not? Mm. That's kind of interesting. Two enclave outposts in a row that were wiped out. I mean, they should be like the strongest one in the wastelands, right? Who did this to them? Okay. Just kind of scouting the area a little. Need some high ground location. A good vantage point. Oh, come on, just... I mean, the jumping. Okay, a Yao Guai tunnels. Oh, did the Yao Guai wipe? Oh, okay, 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 okay. Okay, so since they're not gonna let this light, I mean, they're almost landed on, on, on me. Okay. Okay, yeah, okay. Now, a dead cloud? Super mutant? Man, that dead cloud. Oh, what, what does it have? Like a. Like a super claw? Oh man. This this look this one looks awesome. Okay, let's let's try. Okay, we crippled the dead claw. Now let's go for the mutant. Okay. Hmm. 
Okay, they're getting separated, which is good for us, actually. Stupid noises. Game's over. Okay. Nice. So where's the final one? Kind of went went far away. Where the where the hell is he going? Okay, let's let's uh, start looting. That guy that clown also has a microfusion cell. Is he using energy weapons? Man, I gotta. I, well, it would be actually cool if you could have like a dead claw companion, right? Okay, well, that will be lore friendly. Come on. Okay, so I should probably explore the, you know, first before we explore that, let's go after the Enclave Trooper and get rid of him. I don't want him to appear, you know, around the corner and blasting my face. Okay, he looks like he killed some of the critters. Here he is. Now, really, that wasn't a miss. Come on. Mm, mm, let's kind of lead it a little. Yeah, probably because of the travel time of the dart is not that fast. Come on, give me your sweet Tesla armor. Sweet, sweet money. Okay, let's go check the Yaogai tunnels. Was it... Uh, no, it wasn't there. It was... Uh, I think it was here, right? Well, I see it on the map, but... Uh, let's enter. So... I kind of guessing that it will be full of Yagwai, right? Just, you know, from the top of my head. Okay, well, it's kind of pretty empty for now. Okay, we take the dart. Reward book. Model, sure. No, I don't want to go up. It's for a moment it looked like a steam pack to me. What can we can we go here? Wait. Come on. Don't stop messing around. Just jump. We can. We can. So does that mean we're gonna go? Oh no, it's just a storage. Empty soda bottle. Sure. Okay, take it. Well, let's see what do we have here. A dead wastelander, you know, usual stuff. Hmm. Come oh, move, guy. Move. Insta smash, soda bottles, pork and beans, pork and beans. Nothing special. What's in the cabinet? Well, okay. Okay. 
kind of disappointed. Am I missing maybe some skill book or something here? Okay. Now. Let's continue in deeper into the tunnel. I mean, did, well, this look like, like like people are living here. Not the Yaug, why? Okay, just jump, man. Man, this jumping. Sure, take all of that. Buff out, right? Why not? Can never get enough of the tin cans. Beer, beer, no. Dog meat, no. Okay. Let's proceed further. Oh, now I hear one. I don't see it just yet. Okay. I will cripple them, of course, with the dart gun first. Because they can be pretty fast. I mean, Yauga are pretty strong. I, mean, they are, they, I would say they are almost strong as the Dead Claw. all the scrap metal another laser rifle in the cabinet okay where was that yeah why okay so what did pet branch in three ways oh man mm, let's see Let's see, uh... Okay, let's go here. This looks like a dead end. And it is. Carton of cigarettes, nice. Always like found, found, finding those. I mean, I don't know if there's a better... Maybe there is. I should check, but maybe some weapons. But you know, I don't. I think there's very few items that have better weight to value ratio, ratio than carton of cigarettes. Bubble gum? Ah, sure, take the bubble gum. Oh, I remembered about uh, that uh, cutlery piece I, I found. It's actually not that uncommon. The, uh, what was it called? The spork? He has the spork. But, <laughs> I mean, it is the first time I ever saw it. Or maybe I saw it before, I just forgot, but I think I would remember the spork. Okay, we came from here. We can go there, or let's go left first. No, oh, Nuka Cola Quantum. Look at that. Oh, look who is here. Oh, they are prob are, were they probably sleeping? That did, did zero damage to Yaogwai, just so you know. What the hell is that, a Matriarch Y? Oh, that's more better. Come on, just chill. No, he's talking about me again. Until next time, this is Ow! and you're listening to Galaxy News Radio, bringing you the truth, no matter how bad it is. Oh, we have a, a katana. Now, I don't know if I, if I have that one. I can bend, nice. Well, I can check. I mean, the schematics there are on uh, misc, right? No, they're on notes. There should be on notes. Schematics. No, it's my first one. 
Pulse Mind Trip Katana. Oh, I'm gonna. Oh, I'm gonna. I'm gonna make that. I want a katana. Okay, that clock is improved. Now we improved 10%. So, I mean, with this weapon, well, you see about the Death Claw Gauntlet? When it says with this weapon, you, your unarmed attacks will have a ferocity and arm. So, maybe the unarmed perks do. Maybe they do apply when you have the uh, claws on and power fists. So, we go here, right? Yeah. Okay. Oh, I can hear I can hear another one I think it's yeah it's here okay that's one oh man they look awesome let me turn off the lights they actually look so bad so, so what are they like a mutants bear and monkeys or something or gorillas and bears or I don't know man but they really look look awesome like well they look like actually something between a bear and a wolf and a monkey I don't know okay I still hear one more but I don't see it let's take everything now we're gonna find him soon enough. Let's loot. There's nothing special. Just the regular metal spoons. <laughs> you use just the regular metal spoon. You use spork, man. Use the spork. I mean, now that I think about it, it's actually like an ingenious invention, you know. I mean, it's not like cut cutlery takes too much space, uh, you know, in your backpack, but, you know, just... Why not? Why not use a spork? Okay, a lot of shotgun shells here. And the laser... And laser, uh... And I mean energy weapons ammunition. So they probably want us to use that against the Yagwai, but that's not needed. Okay, this one is already at, at half health, so. Just show me your pretty head. Oh man, come on. Don't don't move much, please. Empty, man. Okay, so where do we go? Can we go here? Yes, we can. Oh, we ha I have two options. Really? Are they maybe the same? I think they're the same bat, you know. Yeah. Can I shoot through the fence? I can. Nice, <laughs> he, he like, like turned 360 to get another bullet in his head. Oh, we have another location? Yeah, we'll go ahead then, okay. Mm, but let me come back and... Uh, and circle back to see the... Uh, the other pathway that I missed. Because maybe if I proceed more deeper, maybe I will get some shortcut that will... Maybe I will get that shortcut uh, that I... The door that I saw in the mountain before. It is here. It's here. Oh, this is some bigger area. And I hear the Yao Gwai. Let's turn off the lights. Oh, here he is. And 
nice. Man, this place is a mess. What was this place? It looks like some sort of a mine. Well, it doesn't look like a mine. I mean... I mean, it doesn't have, like, you know, the train tracks or whatever. It's usually in the mines. We can jump here, I guess. I guess we can. Okay. Oh, Stimpex, I did so. I did see you. I did see you. Mm, this looks like that's all here. Maybe something here. No. Okay. So we go back or we try to climb here. Now the jumping. Come on. Let's try. My guy, just jump. Just, just. It's not hard. It's not that hard. Come on. It's easy. Okay. Okay. Yes. Just, just jump, man. Come on. Oh man, I swear. swear. Maybe I can. You know what? Maybe I will come back. Maybe this. Maybe this is a shortcut. You know. Maybe. Let's just. Let's just. Let's just believe. For a moment. Okay, where's that? Yao Guai then. Okay, so we are in the den. There should be like stronger versions of Yao Guai here, and there's some skeletons. Another date wa wastelander. Anything below you, my friend? No? Well. Rest in peace. Oh, yeah, there are a lot of skeletons. They have been eating here. What the hell was that? Okay, so how should we approach it? Okay, let's just... Let's just cripple this one. There, you can use like that. Okay, I don't know if I'm tickling this one or something. Is this like a special Yaogwai? I mean, it looks like it. It looks like it. Okay. I still hear hear one more. I'm trying to be silent to he hear better. Oh, he's right here. Well, it's gonna be fine. Let's just blast a few shotgun shells in his face. Nice. Okay, so this is like a big big place let's see what do we have here and then a knife yeah I'll just take the armor of you I right, hear another one what the hell is that rotting brackman come on stop twitching it's disturbing man Okay, 
here one more Is there anything in the water? Maybe something to pick up. Let's let's just check. I can quick save here. That settler. Oh, we all go ident note. Okay, okay. So there is something in the water. No, let's not drink it. Let's not drink it. Whoa, a bubblehead? Sneak? Man, what's what's my sneak now? What's my sneak now? Uh, boom, 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 boom. Skill sneak is 100. Can there be more? Let, let's check. The safest distance between the two points is a shadowy line. And my sneak is increased by 10 points. No, it's 100 again. Ah. Well, I didn't invest much in the sneak. Sneak is the most important stat in the Bethesda games, just you know. Okay. Now, we can actually, yes, we can actually listen to the note. Oh, it, oh it's not an audio log. Nan needs to cut it with these crap stories. About beasts lurking in the depths of the cave. They're, well, they're not fairy tales. Nonsense is scaring the children. Oh man, they had children here. I've set up a makeshift barriers until we have time to make permanent ones. The barriers are there more for my own sanity than anything. We've been in this cave for a month now. I've We've finally been able to get everything settled. It's nice to be inside and not have to worry about raiding parties overrunning our camp at night. We are safe here and that's all that matters at the moment. Oh man. I mean, come on, that's just stupid. I mean, if Yao Guai live in the cave, I mean, you would... I mean, you would notice it somehow. Right? I mean, it's not that hard. They're like big, big bear monkey wolves. Man, look at all the skeletons. They didn't notice that. What an idiot, man. Whoa, this one is very close. And it's doing something here in the corner. So I'm just gonna put one in his butthole. Okay. No danger, sure. Come. Come, my friend. Oh, you stuck? Nice. Okay, a Merc with the leather armor. Hmm. Anything else? No. Oh, I want... I wonder about that area, because I now remember I saw something like elevated area that maybe I could get to. Like that one there, right? Let's just just move. There's some. Wait, where it was it? Was it here? Can we climb here? Come on. Just jump, man. Don't be afraid. Jump. Okay. Damn it, jumping. I mean, it looks like maybe. Uh, I cannot see, it's too dark inside. Maybe, maybe, maybe. No, I think, I think it's nothing actually. This, yeah, it looks like it's nothing. My mistake. Okay, let's uh, use the the dark gun for my first shot. Eh, 
And we probably circle back here, right? Yeah. Okay, what do we have here? A raider, paint spike, and grognak the barbarian. Yeah, yeah, well, that is easily missable, I would say. Okay, let's read it immediately. Mm, sure. Barbarian rage perk A. That. What does that give us? Okay, maybe you should show a few tricks to those, blah blah blah. Which is rank of this perk? All of your melee weapons do additional plus one damage and you gain 10 hit points. Well, I just... I would just took it even for 10 hit points, man. Plus one damage? Oh, that's a little. Yeah. That's a, that's a really, really small buff, I would say. I would guess plus 10 damage would be better, right? I mean... How many perks can you get? Like maybe five perks, so five of those perks, fifty damage, not much, right? Okay, I think I think I made the wrong turn. So, where's that fork in the road? I think I need to go right now. Right, yeah. Okay, so he barricaded himself here. Probably against that close, but I bet that that close the Yaogwai, but he just didn't make it, man. Okay, let's go outside and let's hide because I don't want. Yeah, I thought I thought for a moment it's a, it was an ambush. Okay, so let's continue our our travel north. We're almost at the halfway there. And we're burning here. Vault 87. Was it Wolf 87? Let's... Where's the quest for... Uh, shooting mechanical local flavor. Um, bum, 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 bum. Picking up the trail, right? Yes, it's, it's our story vault. Hmm. I don't want that quest. I will go with the. Uh, hmm. Or if Phillips no. Well, let's just go without the quest mark for now. No, I just made imagination. Okay, this is where I killed the enclave officer. Or oh, the soldier in Tesla armor, that is. Okay, we have... One point of interest here. Can you hear... Was it the boat fly? No, it's a scorpion. What? Come on, it's not dead. I just want to get up to see to see better. Okay, what do we have here? What's that? We have some mutants there. What is he killing Brahmins? Eh, probably hungry. What do we have here? The Brahmin. Another mutant. Oh, looks like... Is it a mu mutant encampment there? Oh, are they... Are they herding these animals? Oh, that's that's kind of cool, man. Just to f stumble on something like that. Let's just check my local map. Okay, what's what's here? This looks like also some kind of settlement. Little lamplight. Oh, here's the little lamplight. Okay. 
ok, ok. Salisbury steak. Take the box of detergent. Safe. Empty. Okay, let's see. There's some reds. Some reds here. I, see. I heard Brahman dying. So. Oh, come on. there. Let's go kill the boar. Okay, so the little lamplight is down there. But I don't want to go there because we're going to go there eventually. Because it is uh, our main quest will lead us there. Okay, let's see the world map here. Lamplight. Vault 87 is there. Now, let's, I'm kind of interested in those super mutants there. Let's go check them. Oh, can we climb this tower? That would be awesome. Let's see. Let's see, let's see. Really, we cannot climb it? What kind of sick game developer puts a tower like this in the wasteland and doesn't let you climb it? Okay, I think these mutants are behind this corner. Can I climb here? I want to have better position on them. Yes, we can. Sure. No, nope, but there's something here. Oh, another center mod. Nice. Oh, you know what? I need to test. Does does the dart gun work on the robots? I would guess. I would guess not. But you know, you can never know until you test it. Okay. We oh, we have another point of interest that we missed there. Where the hell are those super mutants? Did I make a mistake? Okay, Brahmin is there. No. Okay, let's go look at them. Look for them. Oh, here he is. Okay, let's try kill him. Thank you. You're free, Brahmin. Run away. No, whoa, 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 whoa. Don't you be throwing grenades on me. Whoa. What do we what do we have? No, nope, I see one. We have one abominable mutant. We have some sort of a scavenger. Let's help him. Come on. Help the guy. Help the guy. Okay. He's gonna get wrecked. Come on. Nice. Who the hell? Oh no. He's dead. Isn't he? I need to, I need to go and help him if I want him to survive. Well, maybe he's already dead. Cook put some mine there. Oh. God damn it. You know what? Let's, let's try shoot. Yeah. 
I kind of knew that was gonna happen. But well, he's just he's just a scavenger. God damn it! Okay, I need to heal. You can resume whatever you want. You're gonna burn, man. You're gonna burn. Come on. Come on. How do you like it? Would you like my hand of death? Why I still fuck? Can I step into the fucking mine? This stupid scavenger. It serves you right, man. Where is he? Where is that asshole? Yeah. Good. I'm glad that you died. God damn them. For bomb, sure, a back cleaner, yeah. Okay, I need to need to again. There's cripple limbs. Wait, my, my limbs are not what? Oh yes, I'm uh oh I see, I see. So it still uses just one of my uh, of my uh, you know medical supplies, right? That's great. That's okay. Scrap metal. I want the what's that? The fission battery? No sensor model. Okay. So did it heal fully? No, it didn't. Ah, okay, okay. So it doesn't heal fully. I cannot cheat the system. Okay, take this shotgun. Oh, he has beautiful water. Awesome. Wait, what did I get? What did I get? Oh, did I get some book? Did I get some book? And I didn't see it. Nikola Tesla in you. Maybe I got Nikola Tesla in me, right? Or Chinky Town Wender. Oh! I can read that. No, I can God damn it. Give me the pre-war books. Mmm, the pressure cooker. Quantum. Sure. Sure. Okay. Let's just save here. Because, you know, the mines. Oh, I see one. There are more. Are there more mines? I still need to find that point of interest on my compass. What do we have here? What's that? Yeah. Oh, there's I think that's the evergreen mills, right? Oh, look at you all here. I'm in killing raiders. It just it's just so fun. Just one bullet and they're dead. I can kill that one probably, right? Also. What? That was a hit. Who is shooting and why? Because Oh look at the those guys. Just just just, uh, just line up. Line up. Line up just like that. Just like that. Oh who's there? Who's coming? Oh for fuck's sake. Come on. I'm invisible guys. You cannot see me. Let's just change. Nice try. You probably didn't notice I have an assault rifle. Oh. What idiot. Man. How did you survive for so long, man? Okay, that's one. That's two. Ah, yeah, I probably shouldn't have taken the mat over those. Okay, take that. Hey, man. Hey, come on, come on. Don't, don't be like that. I check for two. Oh, I hate when they do that. I mean, what are the odds? They move and at the exact same time, 
but not exact, but like a millisecond before I press the button. I don't know what I don't know what you meant to say, but I guess it was nothing important. Now I thought that was a miss, but apparently it wasn't, and I'm quite satisfied with the outcome. Okay, I don't need the lead pipe. Okay, we have one dead there. So how much? Come on, just, just, just die, man. It's. Why are you even trying? Oh. Again, he moved. No, 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 I'm, it's gonna explode. It's gonna explode. It's gonna explode. Just run, just run. The car is gonna explode. Weapon mod kit silencer. Yeah, I don't know. How many of them are, are, still, are still left? I see one bomb. That mine actually. Let's use just one steam pack. Still in danger. This looks like there's three, three, three more of them here. Okay, we're in caution. So we can sneak up on them again. When you turn up, you're dead. Hey, I, I gotta say, there's too much of you here, you know? I know you're here. Of course you will. Of course, I, I mean, I trust you. But you won't like it when you find me. Can I go? Oh, oh, here you go up. I thought where were the stairs? Well, or the ramp, however. Where the hell did this one come from? Ugh, that was close. putting mines stupid is this car gonna explode or what it's probably gonna explode when I come near near it oh okay let's loot these poor fellas I tell you you got them yeah finally I mean they should find a new profession well they should have Okay, we have something like here, sure. And I think I looted all of them, if not mistaken. So let's see. Whoa, whoa. Stupid mines. Okay, we are in caution, that means someone is here. This looks like a sniper position, right? And we killed two of them here, right? Okay, one is dead here, the other one is... no, that's the same guy. Here, okay. Well, I kind of want... wanting to find the sniper rifle ammo. Who's there? Young Deathclaw, small rat, sure, nice shot. I just farm XP. It's farming XP in exchange for money. I saw something here. Oh, it's the fallen brother. Well, maybe it's not the fallen. Maybe it's just maybe it's normal. Normal brother. I kinda, yeah, I kind of want to loot his. Uh, why am I in caution? I kind of want to loot his power armor. So. Okay, we're still in caution. Oh, I think he's friendly. Mm, just one guy walking. No time to talk to your type, local. Okay, so kind of doubted that it's only one guy walking. That 
a friendly protectron. It looks like it's friendly. What's inside here? Ooh. 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 Is it a matriarch? I don't want to find the matriarch. No, no, no. Okay, so is it the, that's that's probably the uh, the random encounter, the protectron mole rats, matriarch, and um, and the brotherhood outcast walk into a bar, and and the boar, and the boar also. No, let's not forget about the boar. Okay, I mean he's just she's just tickling him, her. What the hell? I did nothing damage to it. Whoa, that was clutch. Well, all's well that ends well. And I got a power armor to loot. No, please, if you don't mind, I will just take your belongings. Nice. Okay, let's see what do we have here. Probably have another hidden location, right? What? Uh, Signal Papa November. Okay, 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 okay. Mm, radio signal Papa November. Let's check our local map. No, I see it. Okay, let's see what do we have here. Pre war book, Puggle Slim Illustrated, nice. Right from the get go. Okay, let's just uh, turn off the signal. Or take the tin cans. Oh, it's just this, just two rooms? Okay. Okay, take the dart, sure. Purified water, awesome. Buff out, sure. Fancy lady and cakes. Conductor. Blood pack. Hmm. Come on, at least I signed some sort of a note. I would like that. I mean, I can still, but uh, yeah, I can still see. I mean, he died here from I don't know what reason he had food. Probably old age. Or maybe someone coming to kill him. Never mind. Let's see, we got the Puggle Slim Illustrator, that's, that's the, uh, that's the unarmed, right, one. Yes. Head-to-head -head damage, nice. Where is the bonus, 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 that's B. That's second letter of the alphabet, Marco. Okay, you have learned the secrets, okay, with each range of this perk, all you hand to hand attacks do an additional plus one damage again, plus ten hit points, I mean, that's just awesome, I mean, I get 20 hit points for nothing, almost. Okay, let's turn off the light. So what do I still want to do for this episode? I would say, I would say, Charnel House, what the hell is a Charnel House? Is, oh, is the house? No, oh, I thought there was the evergreen mills were there. Probably some some di different direction. I still I thought I I saw something there. Let me just, let's just climb the uh, the vantage point again. No, no, no. no.
I swear, the mines are the most danger dangerous thing in this game. Okay, looks like it's nothing. What's in that direction? Evergreen. So Evergreen Mills is that direction. Oh yes, it's a. Uh, they are kind of in depression, right? You know the uh, depression. What's how you say it? You know the land when the land is depressed. You know, below the surface of the sea, water level, whatever. I don't know. Okay, is that the is that the dead claw? No, just the Brahmin. Okay, what do we have here? Some textures that didn't load in. Okay. What do we have here? And some raider. Wait, or is that is that a talon mark? A dead claw there. But only a young link. Okay. Uh, well, okay, we can we can get back to. So what's a Fort Bannister? Oh, I think the Fort Bannister is the uh, the Talon, the Talon Merc's headquarters. Okay, okay. Okay, let's go to Little Empire, twelve eight seven. Okay, let's go back to Little Amplight and we're gonna proceed north from there. We're gonna finish our episode at the Little Amplight. This is the scavenger car house, right? Yeah. Oh, so the mines, mines, okay. See these three trees look kind of kind of strange. They just look kind of strange to me. Maybe now oh, there are three trees. Three trees there and there. So okay, I thought it was some, maybe some unmarked treasure or something. Okay, where are we? Now oh, we get closer. Let's use the main road for now. Really, that you cannot climb in that tower. It's bullshit. What do we have in that direction? Oh, the super mutants, great. The basher. Ah, let's bash him. Nice. It can, it can. Don't worry about it. Okay, we have another point of interest here. But let's check this one. And we can actually end it then here. It's even farther than the... Farther than the little lamplight. That's like super mutants there. Okay, they're walking inside of the uh, road. I know how that sentence sounds, but it is what is happening. I'm not lying. It's one. Come on, really? Come on, guy. Don't move too much. Okay. That's three of them down. So I don't know what's closer. 
I guess this... This here... It looks like a super mutant outpost. Okay. What did I discover? Everglow National Campground. And what are these raiders? Okay, uh, let's try. Let's start dropping them. Man, I hit a, I don't know, a, like a pipe or something, which, which if I tried to hit, I would probably wouldn't hit it. Wait, are they all these three? Are they look the same? No, they don't. Just my imagination. It's two. That's three. How many more? They all they they all had nail board. That's a strange choice of weapon. Okay, let's see what we have here. Sugar bombs, railway spikes. Oh, nice. Guns and bullets. Now oh, I hear one more. Let's just read the guns and bullets. Reading, sure. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, this, I mean, the gunner's gonna drop them. I mean, he has a minigun. They're not gonna, the raiders are not gonna survive this. Okay. Hmm, I can I kinda need to finish the episode, but, uh,. I just cannot leave them. <laughs> it just exploded from one bullet. Just start, let's just retreat a little. I'm kind of burning through my 32 cal ammo. But it's okay, it's not, not that expensive. You know what? Let's just. Nice one. And that's two. Really, am I missing his head? Just. Just drop, man. Come on. Just drop. And he's twitching. He's twitching weirdly. And I destroyed his gun. Come on. Come on. Just, just, just drop. Just drop dead and... And make it easier for both of us. Man, I have so much point of interest here. Okay, sure, take the pressure cooker. Gecko skin, we don't need that one. Let's see anything inside this car. Nope. Okay, I saw something on my minimap. I know that was maybe a prisoner. No, it's an enclave I bought. Okay, so still we have the raiders that the mutants disposed of to loot. And I think that should be it, if I don't find anything too distracting for me to finish the episode. Oh, 
Oh, the fallen brother. Nice. So let's just kind of climb here for another scenic overlook. Okay, we have... What do we have there? Just... Some super mutants. I think that that's the entrance to the Vault 87. And we cannot enter there, if I'm not mistaken, because it's, it, the reds are... It's the biggest concentration of reds, I think, in the game. Or one of the biggest. Okay, we're gonna finish this episode. Now we're gonna continue traveling north in the next episode. So thank you for watching, guys, and see you in the next one.